My name is uh, Quint Wolberts. Uh, I own a shop called Quint's Custom Colors. We're in Avon, Indiana, west side of Indianapolis. Um, that's what we do. We uh, uh, build hot rods, street rods, you know, collision repair, custom paint. We do all that. Bikes, you name it. Um, this is my 41 Willys I have right here. Uh, built this for this event. Um, I got a ZZ 572 GM performance crate motor in it. Um, you know, of course, had take you know everything chromed up on it, make it the way I want it to do. Got set in here. Uh, the car's uh, all tube chassis car, fiberglass body. So everything on it's been smoothed and shaved. You know, I've had several people ask if it's fiberglass or metal, and that's what we were after. Well, the interior was done. Uh, a friend of mine. Uh, yeah, he pretty much designed it all. I helped him just a little bit with a few things I did or I wanted, but I gave him a little bit of a guidance, but he pretty much created it. His name's Darren Cutter, uh, Cutter's Custom Hot Rod Interiors in uh, Dillsboro, Indiana. Yeah, it's a, it's a one-off make steering wheel, uh, had it special made. Um, it's got auto meter gauges in it. Notice the, the uh, floor, uh, that isn't carpet. Uh, it's a different type of material, exotic material we come up with that we thought we would give it a shot and we really liked the look of it and the way it turned out. On the paintwork, you know, uh, it's a it's a one-off, one-of-a-kind color. It's got, you know, graphic work in it. It's all freehand, um, all freehand laid out and airbrushed in. Uh, it's got some hidden graphic work underneath what you see uh, bright right now. What you see, you know, is... Um, uh, in certain light, if you look at it a certain way, you'll see some ghostly type images underneath the graphic work. It's like a background effect. Different lights, you know, make that come out. Same with the color of the car. Uh, it may look kind of bluish violet here. You get it in the sunlight, it gets more violet into a magenta look. You know, I'm the owner of the car and I'm the builder of the car. Uh, I built the car from the ground up. Of course, I had a little bit of help from a couple of my friends. You know, you got to have somebody help you hold a door to put it on and, and things like that. But a couple of my good friends helped me with it. My interior buddy, uh, my interior guy is a buddy of mine and, and another buddy of mine, Wade, he helped me uh, uh, with a little bit of the chassis work and a little bit of the exhaust work. But um, anyway, the plan is with the car is uh, we're going to, we did this show here, we debuted it here. Uh, we got lucky, we made the grade eight. We're happy with that. We're tickled to death. And uh, we're planning on running the ISCA Pro Show Car Series uh, uh, for the season, the 2019-2020 season. Uh, we're planning on doing that with the car. It starts, it runs, it drives. You can fire it up. And actually, I had to do a spot check in this building, and I put about probably a good half a mile on it just inside here uh, Wednesday when I unloaded for my spot check because uh, that's the thing about, you know, when you're a Riddler contender, it does have to run, it does have to operate. Everything's got to work, everything's got to function, and it does all that. So uh, a lot of people think these cars don't run. This one definitely runs.